Today we're taking a look at the Helix land sale. Welcome back to LimeTube and if you enjoy my videos please leave a like, comment and subscribe. It's free to do so and it helps me massively. Before we talk about the Helix land sale let's talk about Helix and what Helix is. It is a high fidelity metaverse platform centered around the concept of true digital ownership and independent player economy. The setting is in Parallel City which is a one of one scale recreation of New York where you can explore freely, own land, meet new friends, play games and earn tokens. They have already released a founder pass which minted on October the 5th and I did post a video about this already so check it out if you want to know more. And even before that mint they had already raised 3.5 million dollars already. Part. The Helix Founder Pass, there was only 5,000 of them and mint price was 0.1 Ethereum and it has gone up to 0.615 Ethereum. Now I sold these two early, I sold around the 0.3 mark. If I held on I would have made a bit of money but I don't know why I didn't. I did really like the project but I think there was other NFT projects I wanted to mint at the time too. But for those of you who did hold on you're clearly in a good position and there was also a free vehicle drop as well. So really the best way I think of Helix is a GTA style world with digital assets and NFTs as part of the ecosystem. For example the vehicles in the game are NFTs, the clothes are NFTs and even what the land. Is, which so is what now. does the land look like? So introducing Parallel City's residency, your very own fully customizable home in the heart of Parallel City. This isn't like every other metaverse land. Here you're going to own a unique building and address in Parallel City. This will be your home base for the game, so essentially like a save point or checkpoint. You will be able to fully customise your residence, fully customise your garage, import and display your own NFTs. This is where the collabs come into place. So if you own one of the collab projects, you will get a special NFT in game. You can import custom meshes, textures, assets. There's going to be exclusive in-game items included in your residence and you can invite other players to come join and hang out in your residence. This is all really cool and being part of a game, if it takes off, it's going to do really well. So there's going to be an interactive land map coming out soon where you can explore all the areas in the Helix metaverse. Upon mint you can get different kinds of land tiers so there's cozy loft, modern flat, luxury suite, founder penthouse and billionaire mansion. Founder penthouse is exclusive for those who are in the founder pass. The other four NFTs are available upon mint. So the cozy loft features two stories with modern furniture. You'll get a common rarity NFT, two floors, standard furniture set, 50 inch TV, two NFT frames and a custom NFT artwork. For the modern flat, this is more rare, you get a standard size apartment. Once again, you get the standard furniture set and you'll get two 65 inch LED TVs and four NFT frames to hang around your home. And you'll also get the custom NFT artwork. The luxury suite is super rare. It's very spacious and feels like a five star hotel every day. You'll get the premium furniture set, three times 75 inch TVs, six NFT frames and special premium NFT artwork. Now the billionaire mansion is the one that everyone will want and this rarity is legendary and it's going to be huge. After all it's a billionaire's mansion so you're going to have ultra high end furniture, three times 120 inch LED projectors, 20 NFT frames and your custom NFT sculpture and that's really going to show off your richness in the game. And finally we have the founder penthouse which is an exclusive for those who own the founder pass. This is the ultimate flex as it shows that you're an original founder and you can actually display your vehicle in the middle of the living room. You can kind of see it behind here. So the rarity of this is there's going to be 5,000 for the founders. It's going to be very spacious with premium furniture three times 90 inch LED TVs, eight NFT frames and a founder only NFT artwork. So moving on to the FAQ here, what can I do with my land? So the primary utility of the land is as your own very own home base within the metaverse tied to specific address and location within Parallel City. So you can customize it however you want and invite whoever you want to come hang out 
How do I access my land or residence? So your home is tied to a unique address and building within Parallel City. So you simply can drive or walk to it and enter the building. So once again, think of games like GTA where you walk up to buildings and walk into them. It's going to be exactly the same here. How much can I customize or personalize my home? So Helix features an easy to use build-in build mode, which works similar to creative mode in Fortnite or Minecraft. I've seen demos of this and it looks pretty easy to modify and really alter the home to exactly how you like it. It's essentially a drag and drop tool. So what are the traits and rarities of land? Each land features a unique address and a tier level. The tier level determines the size and selection of in-game items which come within the land. So what's the mint supply date and price? There's going to be 25,000 NFTs, 5,000 reserved for founder pass, so 20,000 available. Mint date is 15 December 2022 and the price is going to be 0.15 Ethereum for those who are minting. If you own the founder pass, you get it for free. And when will Helix be released? So they plan to release the developer preview build before the land mint event and exclusively to founder pass holders. But the full game release will be sometime in 2023. So there's a pretty cool trailer here if you want to get to know more. So alongside this website, which is probably where you'll mint it, they have provided another FAQ as well. So let's take a look through these questions. What am I getting with a land mint? So each land consists of your own building, garage and residence within Parallel City. Main utility of a residence, it's going to be your home base. How can you customise it? Pretty much a drag and drop. Uh, land utility, rarities, we've talked about that. So supply and mint date and price here it is in detail 25,000 December 15th and 0.15 Ethereum the format of the land sale is a traditional flat price mint same as the founder pass sale do founder pass holders get land for free what do I have to do to claim it every founder pass you hold grants you one free land mint you don't have to do anything right away to claim it they'll do a snapshot before the mint date and all wallets holding founder passes will be automatically eligible and whitelisted for the free mint. Is the founder penthouse the same as free land mint? Is it exclusive to founder pass holders? Yes to both. Founder passes will be able to mint one free penthouse per pass. It's exclusive to founder pass holders and no one else will receive this tier of land. But the location of your land is going to be random. I'm going to skip over whitelist application and invites code. But those who refer the most amount of people will get a clown heist mask in game as well. There was also a delisting incentive where I believe you would have got a free mystery box. Over at the Discord, they did pop some more information on 7th of December. So let's look at the important details here. So the founder pass free land claim will occur after the initial 20K supply is sold out. This is very interesting. This is a very smart tactic so that people who have the founder pass do not list their NFT below the floor price even before Mint has started. This is very important to help maintain the floor price of the land. It stops founders from selling straight away. Total supply is 25,000 at 0.15 Ethereum. So at 0.15 Ethereum, they're going to be making 3,000 Ethereum from this Mint. That is if it sells out. Each land will come with a complimentary garage. Whitelist Mint will occur at 12pm Eastern Time on December the 15th and will last only one hour. That's a very short amount of time for minting. I do think it is priced quite high and they're trying to add some pressure onto you to make a quick decision to mint it. The public sale price will be 0.18 Ethereum for any remaining NFTs. Rarity and location are completely random. Each land will also have two airdrop traits and these will have their own individual rarity as well. There are four types of land available to non-founder pass holders, which is Cozy Loft, Modern Flat, Luxury Suite and Billionaire Mansion, with Billionaire Mansion being the most rare. Land in Helix will be completely customizable and tied to a physical address in Parallel City. Holding more than one land produces rewards that are usable in-game assets. After referring someone, they do not have to do anything additional on mint day, they are whitelisted. The max mint is 5 per wallet for whitelist and public. Founder pass holders are also granted a whitelist, meaning you can mint up to 5 per founder pass you hold. 
So here's those different incentives. If you hold two lands, you get an F1. If you hold three lands, you get a tank. Four lands, you get a jet. And five lands, you get a yacht. And these do stack, so you will obtain each reward for owning X amount of land. So the founder pass holders can automatically whitelist five people and each person that mints will generate 5% of proceeds back to that founder pass, which is a great incentive for people getting other people whitelist spots. So you could refer five people who mint five lands each and you would receive 0.2 Ethereum just for referring them five people. The beta build is only open for founder pass holders and they can explore a bit more. The next build will be released in January. So that's pretty much everything you need to know about the Helix land sale. I am very impressed with what Helix has done so far and the visuals look amazing. But also the communication, the collaboration has been really good. Only where it's been lacking is the last couple of weeks. I'd have liked to see a bit more hype from the community, a bit more... Um, announcements from the Helix staff as well because they've been a bit quiet actually if you look here this announcement was on the 7th of December and there's not been uh, another announcement since then the price and supply is very high so 0.15 Ethereum with 20,000 supply so it'll be really interesting to see if they sell out or not I think they've done a good job so far but I do think this land sale may be too expensive or there may be too much supply or a combination of both but given how well the founder pass has done maybe that will incentivize others to hold the land for longer and purchase some land too so if we look at the last 14 days the helix pass i think had a floor price of nearly one ethereum at one point it's dropped to around 0.6 ethereum since then with a low being around the 0.5 region I won't be available to mint on mint day so I'm going to watch on the sidelines and see how it goes to determine what I'll do with this. But this is definitely one you should have on your radar and see how the mint goes. Let me know your thoughts on the Helix Metaverse, let me know if you've played the beta and also what you think of the land sale. As always if you enjoyed the video please leave a like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm.